Hey everyone, this is Kendall with TC Fit and we are doing body weight hit today, 25 minutes. Let's get going, make sure you have some water and a mat for the very end. All right, so a little dynamic warm up here. Start into a staggered stance facing sideways. Come down into your lunge. You're gonna tuck your pelvis under so you get a little stretch through your quad. Now center it out, sink low into your stretch. Same thing other side. Lunge, little tuck under, and then sink it down to the center. So really just focusing on opening up through the, your hips, warming up through your hips, your knees, your ankles. Side to side. Gosh, so we are moving soon. I feel like I only have a couple more classes to teach in this space, and then you're gonna see a different area for me to teach in. Last one. And let's do some knee hugs. See your chest, hold it there for a couple of seconds, just alternating. Now we do have some plyometrics today. There's always options for a lower impact. I'll throw that out there. Listen to your body, do what is best for your body for today. One more each. Good, come to the front edge of your mat or your space. Walk it out to your high plank, hold it here. Now, stay into one long line, you're just gonna pedal through your feet. Get a nice stretch through your, your uh, calves. Warming up to your ankles. And a little downward facing dog. Separate feet hip distance, draw your hips up, and then back down to your high plank. Going at your own pace. Squeezing and activating your glutes as you come back down to your plank. Do two more. Last one. Good, now walk your hands back to your feet. Slowly roll it up one vertebrae at a time. As the last to return, center it out wide stance, reverse flies. Head stays in line with your spine, a little bend to your elbows. Stay low into your squat. Last five, four, three, two, and one. Arms out to a T, little arm circles. Now. Stay here on your end, your first exercise. You have a squat, hip flexion, drive your knee up, curtsy, drive it up. Squat, lift, curtsy, and up. 40 seconds on one side, 40 on the other. Then the last exercise, alternating reverse lunges. Go ahead and take a break, you have five seconds. Three, two, left side first, left side. Step it out, drive your knee up, curtsy, and up. Another option, you can always step your foot together to meet the other. But drive your knee up for your abs. So if you have not caught on already, this first section is all low body. Doing good, five seconds. Directly over to the other side and go. Step it out with your right. Tall posture. Belly button in toward your spine. Cardio is up next. Jumping squats, 30 seconds. Well, sorry, we have three, one more exercise. Getting ahead of myself. Reverse lunges are next, then our cardio. Three, two, one, here we go. Reverse lunges. Strengthening your legs. Like Kelsey said yesterday, we got the Olympics going on. It's a good way to motivate. All right, gang, you have 15 seconds. Then you either have body weight squats 
or jumping squats. We go one after another in three, two, one, and go. Cardio burst. Now, option, rising up to the balls of your feet. This is where our interval is. We have a squat to a left, pull down next. Woo, it burns, 10 seconds. We only do this twice. Five, three, two, one. From here, squat, lap, pull down, and stand it up. Pull, and return. If you wanna add a calf raise at the top, you can do that. Ooh. Use this time to lower your heart rate a little bit. 15 seconds. We're back to lunges. Ooh, three, two, one. Now you have a reverse lunge. Front, back, together, other side. Lunge, front, back. Together, alternating. <sighs> Balance exercises. Hinge it forward from your hips. Little bend to your standing leg. Five seconds. Three, two, one, up and over. Side to side, or you can keep it a little bit higher and more of a stepping motion. If you wanna advance it, speed, sink. You got this. This is not our cardio. <laughs> it is, but it isn't. Out, out, in, in. Five seconds. Three, two, one. Out, out, in, in. So here's the slow version. And speed. Go. Switch your leading foot. May take a couple of seconds. Switching the pathways of your brain. Woo, five, we go to a high plank, three, two, one, here we are, hold, just holding it here, you can scale down to your knees, now, if you have a chair or stool around, you can keep more into an upright position, or up against a wall. We got some planks coming up, gang. We come into a side plank next. Last three exercises. Woo! Three, two, stay high plank, side plank, go. 40 seconds each. Now, you can always scale down to your knee, your bottom knee. That's another option. To add more challenge, lift your top leg. 20 seconds. Then we switch over to the other side. One long line. 10, good news, we only do this one more time. That's it. Five, it's okay if you're cursing me. Three, two, one, other side. Now again, think of your modifications. Whew. I'm sweating already. It's humid out. Take water breaks when you need to. Shoulder over your hand. Last cardio drill, mock jump rope. 15 seconds. Square out your shoulders. 
square out your hips. Almost there, almost there. Three, two, one. Bring it up. Jump your rope. Now, you can always do more of a boxer bounce or stepping. Pump your arms. Light on your toes. You can go side to side. Whatever you're feeling with the music. Five. Three, two, one. Woo! 45 seconds. One more round. Walk it off. Oy. I have been watching the Olympics. I've been missing the high diving every single time. I want to see the high dive. I love gymnastics. It's amazing what they can do with their bodies. So, let's focus on this last half of our class. Get that Olympic motivation. Okay, gang, you have five seconds. Squat to hip flex. Three, two, one, let's go. Sink it low, down, up, curtsy and up. heart rate got um, down a little bit further, more to a moderate intensity, not to a resting, 10 seconds during your 45 second break. Five, three, two, other side. Now again, listen to your body. If you need to change the depth of your squat and make it a little bit smaller to help protect your knees, that's okay. If you're able to get that depth, sink it low, come on. 10 seconds, reverse lunges, alternating. In three, two, one, here we go. Alternating. First cardio drill coming up next. Jumping squats. And then that's it, we won't come back and do it again. Whew. Halfway there. Speed it up. Go. Ten seconds. All right, mentally prepare for jumping squats in three, two, one, go. Or rising up to the balls of your feet. If you need to walk around, take a break, go ahead and do so. Join back with when you're ready. We have our squat to your left, pull down. Five. Push, three, two, whoo, shake it out. Here we go, squat, pull, return. So as you stand, press your arms back. So you're getting a little bit of left, a little bit of triceps. Actively think about your lats, this big muscle group right here. Actively activate, use to pull your elbows wide. Ten seconds. That's what body weight is all about. You utilizing your muscles. Three, two, one. Reverse lunge, forward kick, back together, opposite side, alternating. Up and over is coming up next.
Now you can always just do a high kick forward if the balance is a little too much. Five seconds. Three, two, one, up and over. So stepping, or a little bit faster, or low. Speed. Light on your toes. You got this. What's coming up next? Out, out, in, in. Whew. 15. 10. We are feeling our legs. Five. And go. Out, out, in, in. I'll let you know when to switch your leading foot. Cam, baby. One more block. Switch leading foot. High plank is next. Three, two, one, and go. All right, here we are. Belly button in toward your spine. Again, scale down if you're, to your knees if you need to, or even onto all fours. That's another option. Whew. Halfway there. Are we squeezing our glutes? Shoulders over our hands. Side plank is coming up next. Five. Two, one, switch. Now another option. You can always scale it down to your forearm too. It's getting too wristy. Breathe. Breathe through it. Halfway there. And again, you can always scale down to your bottom knee. So these timed exercises is all about endurance. If you don't make it through the entire timed interval, that's okay. But keep your body moving. Three, two, one, switch. You should be feeling your left by the end of this. Coming down to our home stretch. Last cardio, jump and rope. Grab your imaginary jump rope. More than halfway there. Ten seconds. Five. Three. Two. And one. Let's go. Jump your rope. Now maybe this time. Think of what direction you went with your jump rope. Try reversing it. Think of a double jump. Double. Five. Three. Two. One. Done. Grab a sip of water. Walk it off. Grab your mat. We'll do a little bit more upper body and core stretch. You are out of here. I'm gonna give you about another 25 seconds. Keep moving around. Lower your heart rate a little bit. Whee! Okay, we're gonna start with push ups. <laughs> we're not done. All right, bring it down to your knees, down to your mat. Hands underneath your shoulders. Scale down to your knees or full push up. Here we go. Bending down, up, down, up. Ooh, I'm feeling my pecs from yesterday, Kels. Five, four, three, 
two, one. Stretch it back for a second. We do it again. Slowly roll it back up. Ooh, bring it back down to your plank position. Here we go, drop it down. Up and up. Five, four, three, two, one. Again, sink it back to a child's bow, stretch it out. Nicely done. Okay, flip it onto your back. All right, we've been talking about the Olympics. Let's activate our inner swimmers. And we have a hollow hold. Flex it forward, either knees bent or legs long, or even more challenge. Bring your arms up by your ears, holding here. Slightly nod your chin in toward your chest. I'm shaking too. Yes, I am. 10 seconds. Five, three, two, one, and rest. Feet hip distance apart, hands back behind your head. Flex it forward, up and down, up and down. Crunches. Ten seconds. Three, two, and one. Arms down by your sides, feet hip distance apart. Press up to your hip bridge. Hold it here. Slowly roll it down one vertebrae at a time, articulating through your spine and back down. Press it up again. Press, hold. Slowly roll it back down. Articulate through your imprint. And again, press it up. Hold it here, squeeze your glutes. Roll it down one vertebrae at a time. This should feel good for your spine. Last one, press it up and hold. Slowly roll it back down. Your imprint and release. Dead buck, arms up, legs up. Opposite arm and leg, extend and bend. So we're just continuing to cool you down here. We're still working our bodies, working our abs. Awesome job today. Man, I still can feel the humidity in our house. It is hot out. One more each. And now set your feet down, bring your arms out to a T, palms and hands facing up, legs uh, knees separate out to a butterfly position, bottoms of your feet together. Just relax it here. Allow your body to fall deep and heavy into your mat. And then gently bring your knees back together, flip it onto your belly. Let's give you a little bit of extension. Either prone on elbows, guys, allowing your shoulders to draw away from your ears, or if you're able to get your full extension, raise it up to your hands, squeeze your glutes. Awesome job. And now lower all the way back down. Let's come into all fours for cat cow. Rounding your mid back up toward the ceiling and extend and round and extend one more and extend let's stretch your hamstrings send your right leg forward square out your hips and hinge And release, let's switch over to the other side. Square out your hips and shoulders and hinge. You guys rocked it today.
and go ahead and release. Bring yourself up to both feet and just dead hang over your legs. Allow your head to hang. You can swivel from side to side. And slowly roll it up one vertebrae at a time. Draw your shoulders back. You made it, you are done. Awesome work today. Thank you so much for joining Body Weight Hits.